7D, and this is REZ 2024-09, Dasher Grove Subdivision. It's a portion of 193-acre track. It's R1 to R1 and R10 and CG, and it, this as well has county utilities. Mr. Dill. Yes, sir. This is a very large track, and again, multiple zonings, which is uh, going to be shown here in just a minute. You see the zoning pattern, obviously highly residential in this area. Uh, with the expansion of county utilities and paving the flats on road to the north. A lot of investment has been done in this area. Um, it is, again, as you know, the suburban, therefore the, all the zoning is recommended uh, for the planning and future land use standpoint. There are significant wetlands on the property that are still in the process of being delineated, so that will drive some of the design. But this is actually just a continuation of you see here of the 192 acres. The portions there in orange and the wetlands are proposed to be the R10. You'll notice the yellow portion there along Valdell Road is the commercial general portion. And then the purple area behind Azalea Commons, uh, just north of the hand development, that is reserved for R1 as well. So that's where the R10, R1, and CG zonings are proposing to go. Now this is just a continuation so far of the overall master plan of Grove Point from 2002. You'll notice the neighborhood has essentially been built out up into that red dashed line. And what the applicant is proposing here is to just finish it out in accordance with that master plan. So again, you see how the neighborhood is developed following that plan as it was. This is the <coughs> property in question, 192 acres more or less. And again, you'll note that the applicant is proposing more or less to follow that same plan. So with that being said, and all the factors considered by the Planning Commission, the TRC, recommended approval with two conditions. Condition one being all lots fronting interior roads and this was some discrepancy on condition two, that the connection of Dasher Grove to Valdell be completed at 120, which is the recommendation, uh, once 120 lots have been platted, that the connection be made to Valdell. The Planning Commission considered this and recommended it be increased to 200 lots. So once 200 residential lots have been platted, then the connection from Dasher Grove to Valdell be required to be completed within 120 days. Any questions for Mr. Dillon? Thanks, Mr. Chairman. I was just wondering um, what type of timeline are we looking at with that Valdell and the widening uh, improvement project? Well, it's, it, it's proposed to be in the TIA 2 if it, if it passes on the referendum. Uh, and if I recall right, Mr. McLeod, you might can verify, it, but it's in, in the Tier 1 of that project list. Yes, sir, that is correct. Yeah. And so everything else is moving forward a little quicker than what was proposed. So we may be looking at 26, 27. Yes, sir. If everything keeps moving forward and peace blocks is approved, I believe you'll be looking at 2027. Yeah. Is that when the next referendum on this issue is? No, is. no. The next referendum is this Tuesday. Um, or this coming up Tuesday. Uh, but it's on that referendum as part of that that uh, of TIA 2 and so by the time TIA 1 ends and TIA 2 starts we're probably looking at 27 uh, before that that it's uh, widening on Valdez Road to take place. Were you inquiring about the road widening or the intersection improvements? Both because you, you know the big issue we keep running into is complaints on the traffic and congestion. Yeah. Mr. The, McLeod, can you help us on the yes. timeline on the intersection portion? Yes, sir. We've got 70% complete plans for the intersection. Our plan is to bid it out by the end of May. So work is taking place during this summer and before uh, the hand development is complete. I hope by the end of the year that should be. And that'll be the intersection. That's the intersection of Valdale and North Valdale. Okay, and I guess, and like you said, the, the remainder of Valdale, the widening will take place by 20. 27. So. Oh, everything goes to plan. Start 27. Any other questions? Okay. We'll move on 